Hey Ray, so today I thought I'd do a review of two of my favorite pencil cases that I owned. It is back to school time, so I thought I would do a review because I always get compliments, especially on this case. Um, where did you get it? How much? Oh my god, it's great. So I thought I would show everybody in case you're looking to buy a pencil case, whether for work or for your journaling or, you know, at home or to take with you so if you're a student. So let's go with this one first. So this one is um, a Vashi. I hope I'm saying that right. I got these on Amazon. I will put the links. And I, with my job, I work with kids, but I travel around and I'm also back in school. So I need to have like a lot of supplies with me. I need to have my highlighters. I need to have pencils, um, you know, staples, stapler. I need to have all this stuff, sticky notes. I kind of have to have that stuff, scissors with me all the time. So I needed a really big pencil case. And this case is um, nine by eight, seven by six, and then three inches wide. And I will open that up and show you. Now I've had this and I've used this. Um, so it's not brand new, so if you see like a little dirt or whatever, it's because this is very well loved and very well used. So the first thing is you have these zipper pockets and then you have these. It fits up to like 72 pens. I don't use all of these, so generally, I don't use this one. These two come out. So you can take these out. This one I don't even generally use. I don't need it. Um, so I just kind of have this one and this one in here. Okay. So then you have your back pretty deep pocket here and then another zipper. So generally what I do, and I'll just put some stuff in here quickly, is my stickies kind of go in here. So these are separated, um, so maybe I'll put like the bigger one down here. Uh, I might put like the smaller ones here. Okay. And then I will put my mild liners. I'll put some in here. Because again, I carry a lot of stuff with me and at any given point I might need a highlighter a colored pencil, a pen, a pen, regular pencil, um, staples, paper clips, a lot of stuff I need. So I'll put these, um, some of these in here, and then I would put like some regular pencils in here, maybe kind of zoom in for you. Um, so it definitely fits a lot. I mean, 72, you might not even need the second one you might be good with. So, um, I have a lot of these, um, these are the friction pens that erase. So I have these, and then I, these are my erasable friction highlighters, which I find especially erasable things when you're working with students um, are good. Just remember that if it gets extreme heat, their work will erase. Um, then I have these colored mechanical pencils. Um, so I generally put these in. So the thing I like about this is big. I mean, I, I searched Amazon for a long time before I chose this pencil case. And to me, like, I really did search for a few, for a while. And um, for me, this had the best space because I can organize the pencils, highlighters, and everything that I had. Well, also, these are also like my zebra. I love these mechanical pencils. Um, it gives me the space. I could organize, you know, I could put a lot of my supplies in here. This one has like the bigger, so you could put different size. I mean, I guess I could probably put a glue stick in. I don't, I generally put like here, like my geometry, like protractor. I usually keep the scissors here, staples. I have like a bag of like paper clips that I put in here. Kind of like a pencil sharpener. We have like a little ruler in here. Very important, very stapler. I mean, that's super important to stapler because you always need a stapler and scissors. And tape. I mean, you can throw tape in here. Definitely room. Um, and there, and you can see there's a ton more room. If you have your calculator, you can throw that in there. I don't normally put the calculator in here. I mean, I could. Um, so yeah, so I mean, I'm just kind of throwing stuff in here, but you have the pocket here. And then, you know, you have the two pockets that are separated here to put your stuff in, which I find is so useful. Okay, so this is the Vashi 
This is my favorite pencil case. I highly, highly recommend this. I will put a link. They come in all different colors. I think I paid $14.99. It might be $15.99. I don't know if they change by colors. Um, so I will put a link down below for this case. Um, and like I said, I reviewed a lot of them. For me, this was perfect because there is so much room. Again, I can put my calculator. I can put more sticky notes. I can put everything in here. This, this racers, pencil sharpeners, you name it, it goes in here. And this is a home cube. Well, this one's a little bit smaller. And it says on the, I wrote them down, dimensions that this one is 8 by 7, 6, and then it's 3.2, which it says it's bigger, which says it's higher than this one, but I don't, I don't know, maybe it stretches out, but it doesn't seem like it's really higher. Don't need to carry so much stuff around. This one is fine. Um, cause you do have a lot of like zipper pockets here. You got a little, um, I put some lead in here. You have a little fold down. You can put your pens in here. So generally if you don't need to carry that many things with you, especially I guess if you're a student, cause I mean, I carry a lot cause of work. Um, and I kind of switched off where I was taking the big one to work. And like I said, I'm um, working on my special ed certification. So I'm back in school and I have to go to classes, so I kind of was carrying this one to school, but it still gave me a variety of options of have, you know, I could have my highlighters, I could have some pencils, you know, here I go, and you can just kind of pop them in here. One of the things, um, and again, I put my, you know, sticky notes in here, and I can put some different sizes in, sticky notes, I have lead in here, um, I generally put some paper clips in here. Actually, I think I put my sticky notes. So I put my sticky notes in here. Um, it comes with this little card saying like if you're not, um, if you like it, review them. And if you don't like it, you know, they have a support to contact if you're not satisfied with your purchases. So in here, you know, you can pop in and you put your calculator or pop something in here. Okay. So this has a separate zipper part. Um, it's, you can't really put that much in. However, it shows that like this comes out like a stand. If you can see, like you can stand this up and you can stand up pencils in here, right? However, when you put it back down, they kind of stick out. So. It's okay when you're working, you can put this up. That's great. You can pull your stuff out. But when it's flat, they don't sit in here. So I kind of, this kind of confuses me a little bit. Um, and I don't use this section. Generally in here, I'll just throw some extra pens or, you know, like maybe sticky notes or something. I'll throw, you know, I guess I could put the calculator in this section. I mean, if I wanted to, I could... I could put a calculator in here, my scissors back here. I leave my scissors in here so they don't kind of rip through everything. So, I mean, you could put stuff in here, throw some more papers. Um, there's a lot of room in here. Um, so you definitely can fit stuff in here and you have the pockets, which I like. I like that you have like these little zipper pockets to separate stuff. You can definitely put stuff in here. Like I said, I keep my lead in here. One thing I do like is, you know, like having these, these are kind of a pain to get in and out. They're very tight, especially the smaller ones. So I definitely like this feature of having, being able to take these in and out so much like this. That I really, so that's one of the things I really like about this one. Um, and I like having all the different section parts. Here's another section back here that you can put some papers or like stickers or something in. Um, you know, you got your room back here that you can put scissors or you know, others like your little stapler and stuff can go in here. And then you have this back section. Like I said, I, I don't know how useful this is, but you could definitely put a calculator back here, zip it up or some sort of like, maybe you had like a little journal or something you could put in there. Okay. And one other thing that also I like about this one is that it has these pockets right here that you can actually, you know, you can stick something in right here. So I like the fact that you have those little pockets that you can stick your, so you can put some stuff in there. Okay, so overall, um, two great options. You know, this is a, definitely a smaller option that fits a lot. And then you have the bigger one, um, you know, 
depending on where you are. And this one too, even like I was using this before I was back in school, I was using this just like for my kind of journal stuff, so my planners. So I just had this like kind of in my desk drawer and it didn't take up that much room. I mean, this one definitely takes up a lot more room. I hope this was helpful for you. Um, I will have links below. I got these on Amazon, very reasonably priced. Like I said, I think this one I paid $14.99. It might be $15.99 now, and I think this one was maybe $11 or $12. It wasn't 13 at the most. So not that expensive, definitely. Um, I've used these now probably for almost a year, and they've held up great. They're not falling apart. You know, definitely durable. I throw them in my bag, and they're definitely well used. Alright, thank you so much for watching. Have a great day.